Just like the Photon Jordan 4, I feel like the Seafoam 4s is one of the most highly anticipated Jordan 4 drops this year. So today we're gonna review them together and we're gonna see how they look like on feet at the end of the video. So stay tuned for that. But before we get into all of that, make sure you subscribe to the channel for more videos like this and like this video so YouTube can push it to more people. Get into Jordan 4s coming in new different boxes, but as you can see, this time they went back to the OG boxes, bro. Black top layer with the oversized Jumpman flight branding on the top. You got the Jumpman in red and the flight text in white. And down here, we got that gray and the black splatter effect on there. And we got the Jumpman air branding on the sides. Now, let me take this off, and you guys are here for the Air Jordan 4 C font. <laughs> opinion this is a must have in my collection because first of all i'm a jordan 4 kind of guy but also i wanted to see them in person especially the color it is easy to match it with most outfits bro now getting into the details of the shoe for the colorway we got pretty simple color blocking same thing as on the fire red jordan 4s we have white black and that seafoam green but this right here is the official colorway white seafoam dark ash and neutral gray and yeah there it is I think this is the neutral gray they're talking about on the outsole. The majority of the upper is the smooth white leather. The same thing as on the fire red four. On the sides, we have the eyelets in that seafoam green color and they're attached to these black wings. And then underneath that, we have the signature Jordan 4 netting in white with the black background. We also have that on the bottom portion of the tongue. You got your flat style laces in the white color. And the top portion of the tongue is covered in that same white smooth leather. And on top of that, we have the Jumpman Flight branding patch with the Jumpman logo in that seafoam color and the flight text in black. The back of the tongue is lined in that seafoam green color with the classic upside down Air Jordan branding. The sock lining is also in that seafoam green color. I still have mixed feelings about this, but it is what it is. It's not really a deal breaker for me, but I just feel like they could have used another color right there, but I don't know, bro. Your insoles are also in that seafoam color with the black Jumpman logo in the back of the heel. Going to the back, we have that black heel tab that you see on your typical Jordan 4. And then in the center right there, we have this Jumpman logo in that seafoam green color. The upper portion of the midsole is painted in black and the lower portion is painted in white and the Nike Air unit in the back of the heel right there. And the mud guard is also printed in that seafoam green color. Now moving on to the bottoms, this is a standard Air Jordan 4 outsole. We got a mixture of white and that neutral gray rubber and we have uh, that seafoam green color in there too. And you got your Jumpman logo in the center right there in that seafoam color again. Now in terms of sizing, since these came out exclusively in the women's sizing, in my opinion, I think you should go one and a half size up of what you normally get in a Jordan 4. And you're gonna be all right, cause for me, I'm a true size 11, but when I get my Jordan 4s, I like to go half a size down. So that's 10 and a half. So for these, I got size 12, which is crazy, but it, it worked out for me. Retail price is ridiculously coming in at $210, but overall, this is a pretty clean pair, bro. And I feel like you can match it with anything, bro. And if possible, I'm finna put some outfit ideas at the end of the video. Let me know your thoughts on these down in the comments if you already got them, or ask me any question about them in the comments, bro. And shout out to Good Kicks for hooking me up. Their details are gonna be down in the description box. Make sure you check them out. And I got a $15 off discount code down in the description. So make sure you check that out too. And with that being said, bro, let's hear how these look on feet.